Welcome to the Andrew and Laura McCain Art Gallery. I'm Jennifer Stead, Director and Curator. And today, I'd like to welcome Owen to the gallery, who has just brought his work for a show that opens on May the 15th. Welcome, Owen. Thank you very much. So, hello, my name is Omi Nisami. Um, I'm a fine artist. I'm from Belgium, living in New Brunswick. I'm presenting you my, my work, Human Variation. So I come from a, a musical background family who, who are actually uh, professional musicians from an orchestra. So I'm coming from uh, listening to music from a little boy from six till now, going to, the, going to the backstage and seeing all those instruments and especially all the mechanisms. I've been so uh, influenced not on the music itself, but on the mechanisms and I'm sort of playing around with manipulating all those little intricate little details and, uh, and putting the spectator in questions, and especially myself, but done, having done a, a BA Fine Arts in England, I sort of learned how to, uh, to, to develop ideas. When I do my watercolours, um, I see it differently. Um, with certain elements of certain details or with watercolours, I, sometimes I put more pigments and less water so that the certain pigments stands out better. Uh, I even use some uh, white egg, uh, of which I mix it up with the watercolours, so that it sort of uh, dilutes and makes more transparency. But in the same time, um, I sort of cheat on the, the mixture with the watercolour with the white egg, for example, and it makes the pigments actually stronger when I put less water, and so it stands out even, and it creates a varnish, which makes the quality, quality stands out even more. For example, in this work, um, in my watercolour, um, I'm sort of playing around and putting the, as the same idea of putting the person in question. I sort of played the, the human body this time, and let's say less the musical theme. And because in my work, time goes by, the evolution starts, you know, at one point you sort of calm down with the music and keep going on. Uh, on something and other subjects and so here for example I've played a, a bit like on the, the human body and uh, I took a, a detail of a body and I sort of put, made it in, put, it, uh, put the spectator in question saying what is it? Is that a, a breast or is it not a breast? Is, it, is that a part of uh, the back of something? Or So it's really putting it in question that's why this painting is called uh, Nude Free. So, uh, 